Hello everyone, I am forecaster Andre Brooks for the USA Severe Weather Network and this is our 2017 hurricane season forecast video and in this video we're going to be covering on what this hurricane season is going to do the dynamics that play a big role in it the the greatest impact areas and also on what exactly are we forecasting here at the USA Severe Weather Network? So let's see what this hurricane season has in store for us. Firstly, we're going to look at the dynamics. Now you can see we have a neutral Enzo. We're thinking it's going to be more neutral. Earlier forecasts had said that an El Nino was possible, but it's becoming less and less likely. So now we're going to just see mainly an Enzo neutral sort of year. Also with that, we have a positive AMO forming. And what that is is an Atlantic multi-decadal oscillation. And what that does is increase an uptick of hurricane activity in the Atlantic. And that means the MDR is positive above average waters in the Atlantic, in the MDR. And then in the subtropics of the Atlantic, it is below average. And then in the North Atlantic, it's above average. So we're thinking we're going to be seeing a positive AMO, which will uptick the hurricane forecast. And also, we're going to be seeing a constant high of this Bermuda high pressure. That's going to be mainly in the vicinity of the United States and to Bermuda, which means that we're going to be seeing a pretty good amount of landfalling systems, which I will show you on the next on the next slide. And also, we're going to be seeing light trade winds, and this is a big key. When you have fast trade winds, you can't get the waves to slow down, which means that you can't um, have those tropical waves develop fast, you know, enough to develop into tropical cyclones. So, let's see the impact areas. Now, the impact areas are mainly in the Caribbean and in the Gulf of Mexico. We, we believe that uh, a very high impact is likely, to pos possible to likely, in the Caribbean and in the Gulf of Mexico. And we're thinking about a neutral impact area in the MDR and within the southeast coast. And the reason why we think this is because mainly all the storms is going to be driven into the Caribbean and the Gulf of Mexico with a few southeastern um, coast um, impacts. And within the MDR, the reason why we're saying neutral is because we, we will tend to have may, maybe a um, Saharan dust layer here and there. It's not going to be super moist, but we're thinking it's going to be enough to where it, the impact area is neutral in the NVR. So, what is our forecast, our final forecast as of May 22nd, 2017? We have 14 named storms, so this means winds of 39 miles per hour or higher, then 7 hurricanes, which mean 74 miles per hour or higher, which is the winds. And then we're going to see three major hurricanes, which means winds are 111 miles per hour or higher. So everyone, this is our 2017 hurricane season forecast. Everyone, please take this seriously. Please um, stay tuned into the National Hurricane Center for more official forecasts and expertise. And also, please be prepared during this hurricane season because... It only takes one, regardless of numbers, to make it a horrible year. But that being said, I'm forecaster Andre Brooks of USA Severe Weather Network. Continue to like and subscribe to my channel, Andre Brooks. And continue to like and share our weather page, USA Severe Weather Network. Everyone have a great day. God bless you. And stay safe during this hurricane season.